Hello Libra, welcome on my channel, Triple Two Charo. I'm gonna do your July 2024 monthly prediction. What's happening for you? What's coming next? It's going to be a general reading, so please take what resonates and leave the rest. Book a personal reading. Everything is given in description. Reach out to me on my email address. Follow me on Instagram. Link is given in description. Do not get scammed. I will never contact you anywhere on social media. Sun, moon, rising, any placements in Libra. You can watch this reading. You can even switch the energies if you're cross-watcher. Let's go. Let's see it. I think the cards are there. Where am I at? I need to put them. Oh, that's you. Oh, that's you. Let's see. Let's see what's happening for Libra. Five of Cups. Six of Swords. Wheel of Fortune Reverse. So, first thing first came up into my mind, your mood swings is definitely going to be there in this month. You will be, um, you will be on the loop, like feeling lonely, alone, thinking about something, thinking about the things that did not go well for you, thinking about the missed opportunity in your missed opportunities in your life. And then sometime you'll be like, okay, fine, I have to be, it's like you will be uh, thinking logically and sometimes you will think be we will be thinking uh, emotionally there's something that going on here four of swords yeah your mind is restless you need to stop thinking about something hmm you're gonna feel lonely I don't know why you're feeling lonely or tired or exhausted nine of my nine of pentacles some of you it could be financial thing that you're not Getting what do you want? Yeah, King of Swords, that's you. Yeah, you need to mentally move on from something that's not working for you right now. Yeah, there's something about you are in some type of a cycle here. Like keep thinking about things that's not. It's like you need to break the cycle that you're in. Some of you, I don't know why you're you're you you maybe gonna feel like you're not lucky, you're not happy, you're not satisfied. You're going to feel this type of thing. It's a negative thinking that you need to stop this pattern. You need to cut this shit out. The Empress. Okay. The Fool card. Mm. What's going on? You could be dealing with Taurus, Libra. Another Libra could be Sagittarius, Pisces, Aries, Aquarius. I'm picking up Capricorn. Cancer. Ooh. there you go you could be dealing with somebody who's already in a relationship and this person is gonna try with you this person is going to make a move on you with a chariot and it wants somebody gonna make a move on you but they could be already in a relationship or this is somebody The problem is that either they are in a relationship already or they don't want to be in a relationship. It's like not in a committed way. Like they just want to be with you. Want to go with the flow. I, if, you, if this is not your thing, please don't put yourself into it. This person is very, very attractive and drawn to you. Like they literally are putting you on pedestal. Now some of you, you could be missing your mother. You could be missing uh, your parents. Okay, there's something that you're missing, like it's a cycle that you keep missing it. Um, you could even have some type of unfinished fist. Yeah, so this person cannot speak up when they, they, they look at you, when they think about you, they cannot speak up. They don't have the right words to say to you, but they have their eyes on you. This is somebody who live far away from you with a six of swords and eight of wands and chariot. There's a distance. I don't know now it could be. Here, short distance, like this person live in a different city, town, place. But I'm picking up it's a country because we also have the fool. Maybe this person even thinking about to take you somewhere so you can, they can talk to you, you know, well, while you both are traveling. So this person maybe want to show you. I think this person cannot speak up that very well. So this is their way to express their love to you or feelings to you. Maybe they want to take you somewhere. They want to show you the, I'm hearing the world, like they want to travel the world with you, they want to travel the places with you, whatever you like, like they're going to give you, they're going to provide for you, but 
This person is king of swords. It's like they're not that type of an emotional or romantic person here. They're very logical. They're very, uh, what they call, uh, somebody who's an action taker, like mover. Like they don't know how to express the feelings in the words, the right words. This person is very, very attracted to you with the nine of pentacles and the empress. They think that you're very beautiful. You maybe may remind them of somebody in their house. They think that you, you're... You can attract anybody, you're very spiritual, you could be very beautiful, you dress very well. This person is going to give you the compliment. I think this is the date happening. Somebody want to meet you. Or then they're thinking about how, <laughs> how to ask you for a date. Interesting. I saw King of Cups. Uh, I think I should take it. This person is going to be hot and cold with you. So this is somebody... Yeah, so this could be somebody that you have some type of unfinished business with. Let's say this person was, they ghosted you and you were questioning where they went, where, what happened. So this is that person, the cycle is like the, 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 they're coming back to you. They maybe want to describe things to you now. Would be an X with a death card, bottom of the deck, Scorpio. Yeah, somebody could be coming back or returning to you for another chance with a full card. They can't get you out of their head with a four of swords reverse. It looks like they don't know what type of connection they have with you because it's like this person cannot get you out of their head. And they want to see, they want to explore with you. With the eight of wands and cherry. I think this person is going to make a move. They will let you know about their feelings. But they need a courage and strength to do that because they get panicked. Like they get nervous. They could be even afraid that you can reject them. If this is somebody who's going to make a move, they're going to be afraid that you're going to reject them. Because you're very beautiful or maybe they're not your type with a full card. Uh, they may be, they keep thinking about you. It's like this person is restless. But this is like something on going on. They feel like it's unfinished business. They need to reach out. They need to, they're even going to send you a message that they're missing you or they're thinking about you. This person may be somebody who want to heal the situation with you. They want to mend the things between you and them. It could be same general relationship and others of you, it's about maybe you have a choice. Definitely somebody's returning and I think it's happening in the month of maybe August because Mercury is going to retrograde. But this person is it's like already thinking about it. They're missing you. They're thinking about you. They may be thinking that you moved on, you don't care about them. This person is acting cold, detached and cool, like they don't care, but they do. So don't be fooled by this person. Yeah, that could be the message for you. Don't be fooled by this person. They're showing like everything is fine. No, it's not fine. You have no idea what's going on. This person having sleepless night, anxiety, tension, stress going on. They could be on feeling so lonely. This person is going to reach out anytime in this month of July. I think in the next eight days or six days could be even next 30 days, it's, ha it's happening. It is gonna happen. Could be on the new moon, this person is gonna reach out in this month of July. Hmm. They will. This is somebody who wanna talk to you. And they just don't even wanna, wanna talk, they wanna meet you. They wanna even take you somewhere. Either they could be coming in, into your place or you will go there. But there's a meeting happening, I can see that. This person wants to meet you. They want to take you somewhere, they want to show you off, they want to show you their, who, who, their true feelings with the King of Cups. They want to show you who they truly are. This person believes that you're worthy uh, of their time, their energy. They're even going to be generous with you. They're going to give you a gift. Okay, another thing I'm now, let's talk about you here. What's happening in your life in this month. I'm, I'm thinking of Libra, I told you like you're going to miss somebody. You're thinking about, you know, going back to the same cycle. It's like a same story. Uh, maybe with, even though you're meeting somebody new, you're going to face the same issue and you're going to be like, why? Why I'm dealing with different type of faces or different people? But the, the, the cycle is same. The lesson is same because you're not learning your lesson. You need to understand your worth and value with the Empress here and Nine of Pentacles. Don't chase anybody. Don't go after somebody who does not even care. They're not even, you know, reciprocating the love. You may be attracting people who are just looking for fun with the full card. They just want to live in the moment, in the present. So, and you, if you are looking for something serious and solid, then you need to look for somebody who is also having planning about the future. So look deep within yourself. That's very important. It's like a self-awareness. I'm also picking up some of you Libras will travel, okay, this month. Uh, you need to move to, you know, like heal, connect with the nature, some of you, you could be thinking about to shift somewhere or go into a different country or place. Maybe for your work, for your business, that's going to be helpful for you because right now, wherever you are, you, th you see that things are not changing for you. Yeah, I think some of you, you need to get out of your comfort zone and go into a different city or town or even country to apply for it because that's where your, your abundance are waiting for you with the Empress and Nine of Pentacles. Your abundance are waiting for you there if you're not here right now. You think that you cannot 
be fully and satisfied in in your life financially your work is not appreciative then i think you will you need to get out of your comfort zone go into a different city or town and if you are a content creator i can see that somebody is reaching out to you they want to work with you so this is going to be a collaboration happening or uh, could be you're attending some type of an event here that's going to help you to meet different type of a people okay but overall i'm picking up there is somebody uh, that you have some type of uh, this person has a very restless energy they cannot get you out of their head so they're going to reach out um but their love uh, like they're not going to show you their king of cups side um you know in the meeting but they they have feelings for you this person is definitely either they were hot and cold with you in the past or they're acting right now hot and cold like you will see that in the month of july too like they're going to you're not going to understand that what do they want because they're going to be they want to be with you basically this person wants your energy around them but be careful you're not giving them too much because it's going to be the same cycle same shit with a different person so you need to stop that i also believe you have a option here but there is somebody coming they want to meet you they want to take you somewhere um they want to spend the time with you they want to get to know you better i'm picking up but they are afraid this person has a self esteem issues they think you're very pretty you're very beautiful you're not going to say yes to them but they're going to take the leap of faith they need the courage and strength to do that and i think they will do it yeah this could be an ex here for death card somebody from your past is coming or uh, this is like they're afraid to reach out they think that could be older than you now some of you this person is already in a relationship that's a uh, another twist in the story here but they still they they still want to spend the time with you it's like they want to meet you they're missing you this is somebody who's missing you they're thinking about you they're going to reach out they um they want to be with you they want to um, that's what i'm keep saying keep hearing they want to meet you they want to talk yeah i mean female this person literally um you you will be the main character in this person's life literally you're going to feel like very special this person is going to make you feel special libra they could be older than you yeah some of you you are going to be the main character in your community in your family because of your work you're also going to attend some type of a event okay that's going to be a um, main event that you will be invited there you will be successful there you will maybe even going to receive some type of a gift there or compliments this person could be coming from a community i told you they could be well known and they're choosing you so it's going to be like wow they're going to maybe they're going to invite you somewhere some of you Yeah this person definitely going through some type of a uh, health issues here they need your help they want you they're missing you they're thinking about you Yeah maybe you see them as a false person some of you so they maybe want to explain something to you Yeah this could be even some some of you it's about occupation like you're going to meet this person through work and you both are going to work together Take care of your health some of you libras please take care of your health some of you you do, you're desperate because you're not have a job you could be financially not stable so you really need to look for the opportunity in a different place occupation like new career opportunities or try something different i also believe that this person could be help they could and they can also help you maybe they're going to reach out to you through work they maybe want to offer you some type of work issue work related uh, thing like offer but they really have different perspective like they just have feelings for you i hope you you can feel it up and pick it up Now this person is stuck in their head. They, they they may be even feeling like right now they can't reach out, or they may be even afraid that you're gonna see them is a the wrong way. Or if if you have a wrong perception, they want to clear it, and they don't know how to do it, how to clear it. So that's your reading. I'm gonna see you later. But there is somebody coming. They can't get you out of their head. They're gonna reach out. I can see the communication is happening back to back. But there's also meeting happening. Are they gonna bump into you? It's like a planned meeting here because they just want to see you. They wanna talk to you. are they going to reach out to you through their work or maybe they may be even going to ask you for some type of a help here so that's your reading on us you later bye